Well, guys, welcome back. Oh, man, kind of doing some urban bow hunting today, you could say. Um, not really, but I did get permission to finally hunt a little bit of private land, which is nice. And uh, spotted a couple deer back behind the guy's garage shed. And so I worked my way around, and uh, I hung tight. I couldn't move. The deer were up on the ridge. I watched them for like two hours, a little over probably. And I did have the GoPro on, I believe, um, when I shot. not what you want to have happen um i probably won't even put the the finishing shot in there just because nobody wants to really see that uh i hate i hate that but anyways i'm sitting right here a doe and three does are bedded up on this ridge and i sat here and i tried to crawl out here to get behind the trees and i could not move like literally that doe pegged me every time so I tucked back in and she came and walked right down here, stopped right in that opening and ranged it at 30 yards. And as you can see, she's laying right there. First shot, I shot and uh, she ducked the string a little bit. I pegged her right in the shoulder so she immediately buckled and then uh, I ended up putting a, another shot on her, obviously busted both my arrows, which I don't care. I hate making a bad shot like that. I'm just glad it wasn't like guts or something, and she went down and I was able to finish her off quick, but man, that's hard for anybody to watch. But yeah, I got the old beater with a heater today, so if I have to, I'll just throw the deer in the trunk, but anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Like I said, it wasn't the best shot, and uh, I'm going to go get her and Get her gutted out and get her back to the car. Well, we leave in Wyoming, or we leave for Wyoming in like four days. Just hoping to get a deer down before. Pretty much had one day to do it. And I got lucky enough. There were three does with her. Well, two with her, but three together. And I think she was the biggest. And uh, yeah, she's laying right here. Nice doe. Alrighty, I'm gonna get her gutted out and get her drugged back to the car. car real quick that way I don't have to uh, drag this deer bloody deer across the guy's driveway alrighty let's go get her real nice pretty doe starting to get gray thank you all right guys start dragging Almost forgot. Alrighty. Good size dough. Almost to the car.
freezer full of meat again. And hopefully we'll have a couple antelope to top it off here in the next week. All right. There we go. Alrighty, well, I make this into a video, you'll see it this far, I guess. I don't know if I'm going to yet or not. I'm still pretty upset about it, but it happens to everybody. It's part of hunting. Yeah, I don't know what else there is to say, but didn't have a cameraman. Jeremiah's got to work. So, uh, just a little self-filming with the GoPro. You can kind of see it on there. Um, not the best, but kind of still get the gist of everything. If I'm gonna get this deer bag, get it hung up, cape it out so it's a little bit cool, and then uh, start cutting it up. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. I better give the landowner a call too and let him know that I shot one out here. I told him if I if I did shoot one, I was gonna let him know. So, Odie. Hi. I got some good news. You got one. Yes, I did. I saw three right away walking in. Got back down behind your shed there and I saw a couple deer bedded on the hill so I snuck around the side of your shed and I sat there for probably two and a half hours waiting for him to stand up, give me a shot. So I had to sit there and wait and yeah. wait. And finally, uh, the one got up. I sat right behind there and she walked out and I shot her, so. <laughs> so if you want any uh, venison before rifle season, let me know. Well, anyways. The guy that owns the land, super nice. Let me come out here and bow hunt his property. It's only a 20 acre chunk, so it ain't very big, but it's got deer on it. He was happy to hear I got one, so I'm gonna get out of here, get the deer back, and uh, we'll go from there. The girlies. Daddy got a deer. Yay, daddy. <laughs> Yay, daddy. Oh my gosh. What is that? What is that? A deer? Bambi. It's the freaking big one. <laughs> Ain't no Bambi. Over a hundred.